What's up guys? Welcome back to Fist. We're going into the underwater base and we get the oxygen mask there. Yeah, we're going to be the first rabbit in the world who can breathe underwater. Yeah, the oxygen mask, it'll make it so... You, obviously you can swim underwater for an infinite amount of time. We get that and we can't 100% the underwater base yet. A lot of the underwater base, probably more than half, you can't actually, you can, you can cover, you can cover most of the ground, but it's probably like 50% of the secret areas you can't actually enter because you need the ability which lets you sort of destroy walls underwater and we don't have that yet. Um, so mostly underwater base, like I say, you can't explore it all. We're basically just going through the story route, getting to the boss at the end, getting the oxygen mask, obviously getting a few collectibles on the way and then finishing off by getting back to the fast travel point, warping to west side, well sorry, taking the subway. You're going to get on the train, take it to uh, the west side, ready for the next part. We do get a mystic trophy here right at the start. It's for grappling, I think it's seven, it's five or seven different grapple points. They've got to be different without touching the floor. We do that here, this is a great spot for it because where I'm about to jump up here, You've got about eight or nine grapple points that you can sort of move between. As long as you don't touch the floor, and they, like I said, they've got they've all got to be a different grapple point. So it's got to be. I think it's five. It's five or seven different ones you have to swing on without touching the floor, and that'll get you trophy. So that's a missed trophy we get. And we're not we're not far off having every ability actually. You've got the oxygen mask. Then we're going to get in the next part the. There we go. That trophy there, guys. Bitten by a mutant spider. Yeah, then we get the ability for smashing water underwater. And then the last one will let you dash through obstacles, certain obstacles, or through enemies. So it's basically just an upgrade to your dash. And that's it, guys, really, for this part of the intro. Not much to tell at all on this one. Pretty straightforward. Most of this game's pretty straightforward. It's just, you're just 100%ing. Oh, oh yeah, oh yeah, almost, almost forgot to mention that one. A patch dropped on this. This guide has all been done on 1.03 by the way, but they've just dropped patch 1.04 and they've fixed a lot of the other bugs which they didn't have time to fix on 1.03 and they've also put a feature in to it makes, when you're 100% in area, it makes all items appear on the map. Yeah, so they've just put that feature in in 1.04. I saw it in Discord, one of the... Um, development team they did mention the discord 1.04 there's when you're 100 in area everything will appear on the map but not posters or skeleton chests they've said they're going to implement that in a later patch so everything should appear except for skeleton chests and posters but other than that guys yeah but i'll show you everything you've got the map in the description to use in that anyway but yeah that's it for that one guys i'll leave you to it with the rest of the video I hope you enjoy it and I see you on the next part for another brief intro guys. See you then.
you again. Tell me. If you hurt me, let it be point. I get up at enough talk to Ferguson's. You can shut up. All right.
Oxygen mask. What do you think? The hexapod. Cicero will soon. We better hurry. Contact me when you. Yeah! 